Okay, another Barvember bar modeling challenge from White Rose Maths. Yasmin has some money. She spends £180 on a TV and she spends three tenths of the remainder on a new printer. She has two fifths of the money left at the end. And the question is, how much money did Yasmin have at the start? Now, I'm going to try and solve this just by using the bar modeling method, and I'm going to to try to not be influenced by any other maths knowledge. Right, where am I going to start? Okay, well one thing I'm going to do is clarify um, this part of the question in my mind. It says she has two-fifths of the money left at the end. Well, it says two-fifths of the money and right at the beginning it says Yasmin has some money. So I'm going to take this two-fifths to mean two-fifths of this original amount. All right. Okay, now that I've clarified that, I'm going to start trying to draw a model. And I think where I'm going to start, right, I've got 180 is going to be, you know, some sort of block. I don't know of what size, but I know here she spends three-tenths of the remainder on a new printer. So I think that's where I'm going to, to start. So one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I'm no better at drawing in real life than I am drawing here on my tablet. Okay, so this is the remainder of the money. I'm, I'm going to and I'm going to imagine here, I'm not going to fill this bit in yet. This is going to represent my 180. I, I don't know what size to make this yet, so I'm just going to leave that open. And three tenths of the remainder is spent on a printer. I'm, I'll try and make it easier by using another color. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this is ten tenths. This is the remainder after the 180 is spent. And this is what's going to be spent on the printer. Or this is what's been spent on the printer. Okay. Right, now what? Okay. And that means, and it says that she has two fifths of the money left at the end. This means that this part must be the two fifths. Okay, that's that's what's left. How many pieces have I got here? One. How can I turn make this into two fifths? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well. Um, that doesn't divide nicely into two. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to then do this and I am dividing each of these into two. So, and I have to do the same with these as well, won't I? Okay. So now I'll use a, a red pen here to mark this out. Now I can split this into two fifths. So um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's going to be one fifth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So these two are the same size now. Can you see that? So I'm happy now that that must represent two fifths. Let's have a look. Now I can start to, to fill in the rest of the information here. Because if that's two fifths, whatever's on this side must be three fifths. Okay. So, and I'm going to have seven of these in each fifth. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's going to be one, two, Okay. So where am I? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, 
three, four, five. Okay. That's another. Okay, so I've got an, one, another fifth there. And then Okay. Right, let's get my red pen back out and hopefully that will make it clearer. So that's one fifth, two fifths, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three fifths, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, four fifths. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, five fifths. So that's my whole. Okay, so this was the amount that was left at the end. This here, the blue shaded bit, is the amount that was um, spent on the printer. So this bit here. Is. 180 okay that's the uh, the 180 pounds spent on the television okay and what have we what have we got there so that's um 7 14 15 15 equal size portions here all right so if i divide this means i can calculate what the value of each of these equal size pieces is yeah all of these are this is equal to this is equal to this is equal to this all right so 180 I'll get my black pen back so i'm going to 180 i need to divide that by 15 okay and that's one in there and that gives me 12 all right so i now know that each of these little blocks has a value of 12 all right and that means i can calculate now that i've worked that out i can calculate whatever it is that i want so um what have i been asked is how much money did um yasmin have at the start well each of these blocks has seven so there are five, um, e you know, there's seven in each fifth. So five times seven is 35. That means I'm now dealing in 30 fifths, although I didn't need to know that. Um, I hadn't sort of thought about it. I didn't have to think it out. I just had to draw the model and I can just count up. So I could count them or just simply do um, five times seven. So um, five times seven is me 35. And then I need to find out what um, 35 times 12 is. So 35 times 12 and this is where I've actually just quickly done it on a calculator here gives me 420 okay so 12 times the 35 blocks that I have will give me the value of the whole thing so the whole block this whole thing is 420 all right i hope that makes sense